Let's take a look on how we can differentiate cosine of inverse sine x. Let me show you the easy way. First, let's write a y prime. And the derivative cosine of something, this is going to be negative sine of the same thing inside. So we just have to maintain the inverse sine x inside. But then because of the chain rule, we look inside right here and multiply by the derivative of the inside. Namely, the derivative of the inverse sine x is going to be 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared. Okay? And this is it. This is the construction of the derivative. But then, this is the original sign. This is the inverse sign. They cancel each other out. So, for the first part, we will have negative x, that's all, times the second part is 1 over square root of 1 minus x squared. And of course, we can put them together. The final part is just you put a negative x on the top over the square root of 1 minus x squared on the denominator. And this right here is the answer.